Well, climate change is a major part of President Biden's agenda, an item that will be front and center during his upcoming trip to the UN Climate Conference. There are new climate models that underscore just how serious the problem is, and Sarah Donji has more details. Could 50 cities around the world change completely or even disappear as a result of climate change? One nonprofit says they can and they want to show you how. Their ability to exist into the future depends on the actions we take. Benjamin Strauss's nonprofit Climate Central did the research and created startling images of landmarks around the world, including a few parts of Southern California like Long Beach and Huntington Beach. The Santa Monica Pier is an LA landmark you can see for miles, whether you're here on the ground or looking at it from up above. But this model shows it disappearing completely and looking something like this. This model shows the Santa Monica boardwalk underwater. Projections climate scientists say could come true in the next few centuries if temperatures and sea levels rise without humans intervening. It's really sad to think that it could disappear one day beneath rising seas. The projections range from one to four degrees of warming with the worst case scenarios showing seas rising by more than 20 feet. In these pictures of Long Beach, high tides push in all the way to the 405 freeway and much of Huntington Beach also underwater. It's neighborhoods from Golden West all out to Los Altos would be you know, well below sea level, could be uh, 10 feet almost. While images like these could be thousands of years into our future, scientists say climate change is already wreaking havoc along our coastline. This is not something that's off into the future. This is happening right now. John Dorsey studies rising sea levels and points out losing our beaches and the tourists they bring could drain our local economy and says we'd also lose infrastructure like water lines, sewer lines and highways. If we get this coastal erosion that could erode in and start destroying that kind of infrastructure, we will be paying billions of dollars to trying to move that in. Climate scientists say some of this could be avoided if we take major steps to cut emissions in the next decade.